Hey guys, Rick Nice to be more Mafia 3, so last part we took on all these people and killed them all. That was quite fun. Alright, so now we need to go and find Bakke. I'm guessing he's in here. Off we go. You dishonor your African blood. Fuck you! You come to take my life! You are not right, Lucy. Should've killed me when you had the chance, asshole! First I kill you, then I kill that useless old man. Fuck you! Who want Fuck you! You made a big mistake going after the hollow. The man you're talking about took me in when I had nowhere else to go. You are no better than you! Oh shit! He snapped his neck. You can't take those shoes. You fucking pig! Damn you to hell! Take it easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. He kept me in there, locked in there, day and night. Beat me. Use me. I kiss you, motherfucker! You and your entire goddamn family! He's dead! He's dead! He can't hurt you anymore. It's over. Over? Over? <laughs> this is never going to be over. Pajam! What'd you call me? Fucking Haitians. Get him low! Sammy's boy is in there! Kill him! Got to reload! Alright, we're in trouble here. Oh crap! Molotovs and grenades. I'm alright, I'll stick to guns. What is this? Got a new gun, it looks pretty good, we'll use this. Right, got a lot of people to kill. Fuck off! Is that all of them? I think it might be actually. Get some ammo. Oh no. Alright, I think they're all dead. Let's move up. Another one down. I'm gonna get that gun actually. Reloading, 
Nice. Another one down. Keep moving. Shit. Follow me, young. Catch us up. Move one down. Move up. Watch out. Nice, they're all down. Gonna run me over here. Let me in. Go, 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 go. I gotta get you out of trouble, don't I? You all? I am. How to go with Baka? We came to an understanding. He stayed dead, not let him. Let's get back to Sammy's. Can't even tell you how happy Pops is gonna be. And this shit with the Haitians has been weighing on him. With them out the way, things will calm down. Go back to the way they should be. And tell fuck it, it's your car. Bash it up all you want. I will. Thank you. Where was I? Been telling him for months we needed to do something like this, but Pops, he... I don't know. Sometimes I think he's lost the taste for this shit. Just because a man don't rush to violence don't mean he lost something. I know, just makes me wonder what happens after, you know? No, I don't know. Explain it to me. It don't matter if it's a bullet or the hand of God. We all go sometime, right? I suppose. The Ellis, we don't need to talk for. I pray that Pops outlives the both of us. But if he doesn't, every motherfucker in the hollow is gonna be looking to us or gunning for us. Just saying we gotta be ready when that day comes. Yeah, well, that's not something we gotta worry about right now. So just cool it with your grand plans, all right? Yeah, all right. Okay then, so it looks like we're going to end up with a war on as as at the moment after we've killed him because there'll be people left over who's going to come after us Nothing we can't deal with, I'm sure But if they didn't come after us, then there'd be no point in our game <laughs> It'd be game over already You've killed the guy, well done You're out of debt, game over Imagine if that happened I'd want my money back <laughs> Oh, if you pit, they move out of the way. That's pretty cool. I missed my turn in there, so I'll pit him. Fuck it, it's your car. Bash it up all you want. Once again, I will. Alright, we're here. Fang Lankin didn't understand, or maybe want to understand, is that for a man like Sammy, there's always going to be more Haitians. Now, if there wasn't someone going after Sammy, then there was someone else forcing him into a bad situation. It was never going to end. That's how Lincoln ended up working for Sal Marcano. You were right about those Haitians being down by that old salt mine. They won't be bothering us again. It was a mistake sending you down there. I should handle my own business. This isn't any different than what I was doing before I left. You probably don't know this. But every night on the TV, right after the news, they show the names of all the boys killed over there in Vietnam. I'd be sitting in the kitchen eating my supper, watching that list scroll by, wondering if today is the day I finally see your name. But you never did. Nothing happened to me. There's only so much luck down the well. Sooner or later, pull up that bucket, there's nothing in it. So, what are we gonna do about Marcano? Pay him his goddamn money one way or the other. Lottery gonna be enough to cover it? The lottery? <laughs> no. 
But Sal called a bit ago. Wants you to meet him up the country club. Says he's got something in the works. Square things up between us. The only black folk allowed in there to help. Now, they may not like it, but they're not gonna say no to Sal Marcano. He says you get to come in, you get to come in. Fine. I always did want to see the inside of that place. You need to do whatever Sal asks, yeah? For all our sakes. Yes, sir. Okay then, so that was our first gang killing. Pretty good actually. I like how you can uh, go into a cutscene if you shoot them and don't kill them all the way. So like, it was like that in GTA 4 actually. So I think that's where they got it from. So we're going to end this part here. In the next part we need to drive to the, whatever that says, Yacht Club. And then, I don't know, meet a guy there apparently. So I'm going to end this part here. Thanks so much for likes, please like, favourite, subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Mmm. Bye.